This is part two of the new Android streaming application for Alien and Alien 2. This assumes you've watched part one and have already done the installations of the APKs to your Android tablet, phone, STB, or other device. You'll start out with launching the Spark application. On this tablet, you can see there's two. Spark Remote is the old remote application, which is now integrated into the new Spark one. So, launch the Spark app. It's very simple and crude, as you can see. First thing you go to is Settings. This is where you can configure the IP address of your STB. If you have four aliens, you can add them all here so that you can talk to them individually. This is already uh, connected to our test unit. So you hit the back arrow to get out of that. And we'll start with service. This gives you all the different ways to basically look at your channels. We'll go with satellite. These are the satellites currently scanned into the target STB. We'll pick 97 West. Here's a list of all our channels that are in the STB. So we'll go through, pick Kuwait TV2, get the option to record, play, EPG schedule. EPG schedule is not going to apply to North America since we have little to no EPG data. So we'll go with play. Now this just flip to landscape mode, we're on a tablet, I'm not going to flip it and mess up the camera, but it's streaming the channel now. So you would flip your tablet, watch the channel. To get out of this, you hit the back arrow for your Android. You can select a new channel or uh, Go back again to you know satellite or however all channels however you want to sort. Now some other uh, features. If you hit uh, program, this brings up the current channel that your your alien or alien two is playing. It's got your uh, your bit rate and you know other information about it. Uh, it's kind of an important thing to look at because on a lot of networks, if you've got something with a 50 uh, megabit bit rate, it's not going to stream well. You know, that has to do with networking rather than uh, than the, the Alien or Alien 2 itself. But, so we're looking at the, the data for the current channel that the Alien 2 is playing. You hit play current channel. It'll again play this channel. It's a remote. This is basically the old Spark remote system where you can, uh, you know, basically any function on your physical remote control is duplicated here. And if you go over on the next screen, there's two different screens for it. You know, volume, channel changes, going into the menu. You can do it all here, just like the old Spark remote. Power is simple. You can uh, reboot, standby, or shut down your STB, should you wish. Message is a really uh, neat feature. Let's say uh, the kids are up late and they're watching TV and uh, you want to tell them to shut it off and go to bed. Type a message here, like, uh, we'll just do test. 
and hit send. Right now on the STB, an information box just popped up on the screen that says test or whatever it is that you inputted there. So you can send messages to your STB. You know, it's not really functional, but it's fun and, you know, has its uses. About, just a spark, but that's uh, basically an overview of the new Spark APK and the ability to stream live to your Android device.